What's going on YouTube? It is Robert. Robert Breach YouTube. I'm being stared at by my dog on the off screen here, but uh back for another video. Um I don't have a lot to show today, but um I just want to show off a couple of things that I've picked up um over the week and whatever you want to call it. Um Uh, dogs are acting weird, don't mind me. Um, but I got a, uh, Kahoot win from Booze and Pops. Not this past Saturday. Um, that would be too quick to send here. But from, uh, the following week, uh, the previous week from that, I, uh, won a, uh, it was an 80s movie, uh, Kahoot that I won, um, the prize was a, uh, Dr. Doom, uh, ECCC, um, pop from Target, so I, uh, um, so basically, uh, this is what I won, um, it's probably one of the only couple of pops that I really kind of wanted to, to get out of, um, out of the, uh, ECC, uh, drops, but, you know, I worked, I worked in the morning, so I couldn't really get off work to go get it, so it was fortuitous that I won this, um, I love this pop, um, I'm a pretty, I'm not I'm a huge Doctor Doom fan, but, you know, um, as far as Marvel villains go, he's definitely a, uh, a big baddie to, to kind of root for, but also root against at the same time, if that makes any sense. Um, so, uh, um, this is the prize that I won. Again, Boos and Pops, thank you for putting on the, uh, the Kahoot will be popping. Uh, thank you for putting up the prize. And um, it got here pretty quick. Um, and then all, and obviously, I, I, mean, I had to open it because um, the box was looking a little bowed. But thankfully, you know, he packed the daylights out of it. So pop and, you know, sorter were fine. Um, the next thing I'm going to show you, um, probably, uh, I, I don't know how long ago, but I, I picked up a couple of these comic books, um, and I finally um, was able to, to track down the ones that I needed. I have a couple of extra, but, you know, I got the set that I needed, the full regular set, and now I just need to find some of the variant covers, but... If you remember, I am a huge Back to the Future fan, so I, it's the Biff to the Future comics, um, this is the original one, and then I was surprised because I thought it was just one through six, I didn't, um, but the person, I don't know if they did it on purpose or just didn't read it, but they sent me the variant cover for issue number one. So I have that variant cover. Um, I had picked up the variant cover for issue number two um, back when I bought the uh, first four that I bought. And then this is the original um, cover. And then I had three already. I also had, also had the original two already, so I've got this one and this one that are extras to me. So if anybody would like to, um, yeah, if, if anyone would like them, hit me up on Instagram and we can work something out. Um, obviously, I'm not going to, you know, just hit me up and we'll talk. So that's the third one. This is probably my favorite cover. 
of the originals is this one here. So that is issue number four. Um, actually, I lied, I lied. This one is my favorite. It is Best Pleasure Paradise. Um, I'm going to probably wind up reading these. But then I want to also, um, I was looking for different uh, ways to frame them up. So I don't know exactly how I'm going to do it. But I want to get, I want to frame them. Um, I want to do the same thing with the Labyrinth comics that Carolyn has. Um, just for whenever we move out on our own, we can hang them and show them off. I, I really dig the artwork for the Back to the Future comics. Um, I started with the Biff to the Future because it's only six issues. Um, the regular Back to the Future comics, there are probably a bunch. So, <sighs> so we'll start with these first. But this is the last one. This is uh, issue number six. So I've got these now. I have, and said I have extras. I'll show you what I've got. I just said I've got issues two and three. Issue two, issue three. Um, I just said if anybody watching would like them, um, we can talk. Uh, I'm not gonna. You know, I just said I'm not gonna you know, kill you on price, or, I may even just give them to you, I don't know, it depends on who it is, no, I'm just kidding, but, um, the last thing, I got some mail, did a sticker swap with g pop uh, and actually, after I, after I'm done filming this, I have to, I'm gonna get them out, because, um, I was sick all weekend, uh, it's not really all weekend, but, uh, more Sunday, and then yesterday I took the day off to just kind of rest. Um, honestly, with the corona going around, um, when I felt like when I felt like crap, I was a little worried. But um, you know, no temperature. Um, I feel a lot better now. So you know, back back at it. So let's see what we got. We've got a bunch of his cool stickers. Uh, this is probably my favorite one, but I may change my mind. Um, this is another one of his, and then this is his Funko Plus Society one. Um, I just said, um, if anyone wants stickers, I still have some stickers. I still have some magnets left. Um, so if you guys want some, let me know. Um, I said I have his I have to get ready, and then I have two others from my giveaway from last week that I'll put in the mail tomorrow. Um, other than that, that's pretty much all I've got. Um, I've got a couple of things in route that I'm excited for, so once those come in, I will uh, I'll do another video and we'll show them off. Um, other than that, I will see you guys in the next video. Hope you guys are staying safe and you know keeping your distance and all that and all that good stuff. But uh I will see you all in the next video. I'm gonna go read some comic books now. I'll see y'all later.